You're welcome to Logos of Flame Daily Devotional Podcast. Be blessed as you listen. September 8th. Today's topic is Don't put your trust in man. When we are successful, rich, or enjoying a good phase in our life's trajectory, it is tempting to forget that those achievements are not by our own power. Like the parable of the rich fool in Luke 12, 13 to 31, we take immense pride in what we have gathered and glory in our own strengths. Similarly, it is easy to take delight in the strength of men we look up to, forgetting that they are mere humans with absolutely no ability to achieve whatever we admire in them on their own. As such, we tend to depend on them or look to them for help or guardians. We forget that human strength is unreliable here one day and gone the next. The scriptures warn against this tendency to depend or trust in human abilities. It is even much more folly to boast about them because, as Paul points out in 2 Corinthians 10, any human achievement is of the Lord. As such, all boasting should be in the Lord. In the epistle, Paul tells the Corinthians that those who boast in their own abilities are ignorant because they have a limited standard to measure their strength, a human standard that is weak and subject to God's will. Likewise, the psalmist sees trust in human achievement as a futile effort. He emphasizes in Psalm 52, verse 1, that it's only the goodness of God that endures continually. Humans, on the other hand, are wicked and their evil ways are subject to God's judgment, just as we see in Isaiah 2, verse 11, New Living Translation. Human pride will be brought down and human arrogance will be humbled. Only the Lord will be exalted on the day of judgment. Rather than trust in the unreliable power of man, we must trust in the power of God as the source of all blessing. Whatever we achieve is only obtained through God's benevolence. Those who do not acknowledge God as the sovereign source of all human accomplishments are only setting themselves up for doom. The rich fool is a classic example. He took pride in his wealth and proposed to eat and drink to his heart's content, but he died that same day. When we are blessed, we should remember that God is the source and give him due honor. If we must boast in our abilities, we must also acknowledge God's grace in acquiring that which we are so proud of. As the Apostle Paul puts it, He who glories, let him glory in the Lord. 2 Corinthians 10, 17, New King James Version. Practical Reflections 1. What are the things I am most proud of in my life? 2. Am I guilty of boasting in my own abilities? If I am, how must I rectify the situation and bring my heart back on course? Our Bible reading is from Isaiah 1, 1 through 2, 22. 2 Corinthians 10, 1 to 18. Psalm 52, 1 to 9. Proverbs 22, 26 to 27. Our memory verse is from Isaiah 2, verse 22 using the New Living Translation. Don't put your trust in mere humans. They are frail as breath. What good are they? We would love to hear from you. Please send your messages and prayer requests to our email, office at logosofflameministries.org or visit our Facebook page, Logos of Flame Ministries, and drop a message. God bless.